makes your hair like kinky, kind of a la Zoe 101, and we don't want that. Hello everyone, and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna to be talking about hair care. Um, essentially how I care for my long hair, how I make it grow, how I prevent damage, all of that. So if that interests you, keep on watching. Really quick, if you're new to my channel, hello, my name is Zoe. Um, I make videos mostly about outfits of the week, productivity, work week in my life, um, and fitness, but you know, sometimes I throw in a fun video like this. So um, yeah, I can't say I get a lot of questions about my hair, but I have some tips that I think you guys should know um so i hope you can take something away from this video i hope you like it and yeah it's super simple everything i'm gonna say is really really simple tips and not expensive either um so yeah let's get into it so just i want to make a video all about you know how i grew my hair and that's not really the purpose of this video but i used to have extremely short hair like i had hair up to here like four years ago, three years ago. So I figured out a way to make my hair grow pretty long. And an important part of being able to have long hair is being able to keep it healthy because if it's like just scraggly and like split endy, it's not gonna be cute. It's also important I think to mention that keeping long hair is harder than having short hair. So it gets stuck in things and like brushing gets more annoying, it gets tangled way more easily. So I think it's important to have sort of a routine in place to take care of your hair, um, especially if you wanna keep it long and keep growing it out. So I'm gonna show you guys my exact routine um, for my hair pre-shower. Everything usually happens pre-shower and then a little bit of stuff post-shower. I'm gonna talk about protective styles that you can wear your hair in, and that's about it. It's a pretty simple video, so I hope you like it. So yeah, I'm gonna sh I already filmed the clip because I just got out of the shower. Um, I already filmed the clip of all the products that I use. I just wanna mention that I think it's really important to brush your hair before you shower, brush your hair when your hair is dry. Um, that's gonna like pull out the dead hairs and it's going to just make it easier for like the products to work their way into your hair. And more hair falls out, I find, when I brush my hair wet than when I do it dry. So brush your hair before you get in the shower. And now I'm gonna show you guys all the products that I use. Cool, so welcome to pre-shower me. Um, I just got back from the gym, so I'm gonna do my actual routine and show you guys what I do, talk a bit about the products um, that I'm using. So the first step is to do the hair oil. This is from Parthenos and Nemean. Uh, it's the Amazing Hair Savior is what it's called. The bottle looks like this. Um, they actually sent this to me. They contacted me on Instagram and sent it to me and I was super excited because it's supposed to help you grow your hair thicker, prevent hair from falling out, and just help your hair grow faster. Um, so I was super intrigued and I said, yes, please send it to me. Um, and I absolutely love it. So it's not sponsored. They just, it's like gifted. Um, and yeah, I've noticed my hair growing really fast with it. I put it on the roots and on the tips as well so I like to put on the roots before I shower a lot of the times I will do it overnight so I'll put it on at night if I know let's say I know I'm gonna do a morning workout I will put it on at night sleep with it in work out with it in and then shower it out um, I think I have a little bit in right now I think I put it on two nights ago because my hair has been nasty for days but um, I'm just gonna show you guys how I do it um, for the sake of the video so it comes with a little dropper like uh, like a medicine dropper and I hope I don't make a mess because clearly I'm not in my bathroom um, I put the dropper down along the middle of my scalp and I go like drop 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 along the middle of my hairline and then I massage it in like that so I do that kind of a few times I like separate my scalp in layers so like I'll go here and I'll go underneath and then I take a, uh, do the other side obviously and then I take it and I bring it down into the ends of my hair as well. Another product that I will use before and after my shower is um, what Argan Oil. This is from, I got this from like a perfumery in France, super random, but any 100% pure Argan Oil is going to be really good for your hair. I don't put it on the roots, I just put it on the ends, sometimes I'll load it up as like an overnight mask treatment. You can use coconut oil, you can use olive oil I used to use, like a bunch of stuff. Um, 
so that's really good too so I kind of alternate between that sometimes like when I want to think about saving this I'll just put it on my scalp and I'll put this on the ends but I kind of like to alternate I think it's nice for your hair to like mix it up a little bit so once that is done right before my shower I use this product this is the best product in the world you guys okay I think you all need to buy it seriously I have converted my mom my sister my stepmom my dad my brother everyone in my family uses this product all of my friends I'm like I'll buy it for you just you know like use it you need it so I have the French um, bottle but it's called roots by lush it is amazing okay it's a minty treatment that helps give your hair more volume but what I have noticed that this helps my hair do is grow like crazy so you put it on your scalp and I will show you how I do it. Sorry, I'm looking up because I keep looking in the viewfinder at my, at my scalp. So that's what the product looks like. It's um, thick, like a paste. Like I said, it smells super minty and it makes your scalp tingle. So I rub it between my hands and then I just put it on my scalp and I kind of do this. Like I move my hands up and down and I run it through and I put it on the back as well because we want all of our hair to grow nice and long and then just using my fingers and my nails I kind of just go through sometimes I will sleep with this stuff in my hair and I have gone to a morning workout class um, with it in my hair before um, but it does really like you can see now it really does slick your hair so I usually just do it about 20 to 15-20 minutes before I shower sometimes I'll just leave it on in the shower and I have long nails so I like to just scratch it into my head um, and I just massage it I think the longer you can spend massaging your hair the more it's gonna help it grow but um, this stuff just makes your hair look really nice feel really nice it feels really good on your scalp and it helps it grow so the next step once I'm in the shower you leave this on until you get into the shower um, and you shampoo it out what I like to do sometimes before and sometimes with the shampoo I use this scalp brush um, it has like little picks you can see I ordered this on Amazon for like three dollars and I like to massage in a circular motion I just stick it against my head massage 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 not only does it feel really really good but it um, it's really gonna like push in the product into your hair stimulate your scalp and I think this really helps with hair growth as well um, so that's really nice I like to do that and I like to do it with the shampoo in so I kind of mix the shampoo with the roots product into my scalp then rinse everything out you can also use this in the shower as like a brush if you want to brush your conditioner through you can do that as well so I don't use any fancy kind of shampoo and conditioner so I'm not going to talk about that I will talk about my deep conditioner that I try to do about once a week this is the macadamia natural oil conditioner this stuff is OG like I had this stuff in high school not this bottle but I was using this brand in high school and I really really liked it um, and I still like it it's a deep repair mask I buy mine from winners I think you can buy them at like any um, like hair care place that sells like professional hair products um, I like to put it sort of on the bottom half of my hair so if I were to make a ponytail with my hair that's the amount of hair that wants to get covered in the mask you don't really want to put it on your scalp because it's gonna get greasy if you do it's not a big deal but um, it's better if not so I will do this in the shower after I wash my hair leave it on for 10 to 20 minutes rinse it out and your hair is gonna be super super silky so that's everything I do in the shower and let's get back to the rest of the video so all of those products are really good I really like my shower routine I feel afterwards that I have like nice silky hair it's a bit it's a bit puffy today I don't know but um yeah in the winter time it's hard really hard to keep your hair nice but yeah that's my routine I hope uh, you guys find it helpful again I super super recommend you get the lush product and I super super recommend the amazing hair savior as well I have noticed a dramatic difference in how much my hair is falling out since using that product it has the my 
my hair has really stopped falling out since using it so really really recommend and one thing that I forgot to mention is that after I get out of the shower I do like to put more argan oil on the ends of my hair just to protect it and make it soft because especially in the winter time your hair gets so dry so I use like the tiniest tiniest like drop because otherwise your hair gets greasy um, and I just run it through the bottoms of my hair to make it soft and shiny so another thing that I like to do is keep my hair in sort of protective styles, um, especially when I'm sleeping. Uh, so that is what I like to do. I do like a twist. I find if I do a braid, it makes your hair like kinky, kind of a la Zoe 101, and we don't want that. So I like to just put it in a loose twist. I sleep with it in like that. Um, I yeah sometimes i just go around the house with it like that one it gives a nice wave to your hair and two it just keeps it from getting tangled um so that's one the next one that i like to do is a low bun um some days i will put the oil in my hair um and like go to work or just live my life with my hair in like a super low bun that's like tight and just like slicked back um the oil acts as like a hairspray so that's good you're not damaging your hair with hairspray and you get to like protect your hair um, in the low bun so that's nice I wear my hair in a low bun like at least 50% of the time that's cool so that's everything I do for my hair care I hope this video was helpful for you guys if you have questions let me know I'm happy to answer them and yeah if you have questions about growing out your hair or you want to see a full video about how I grew my hair out let me know I'll be happy to do that video and I will talk to you guys in my next video I upload every Sunday Bye.